tonight we're checking out Sukata Nojo. They are a new izakaya that opened up, I think, in the last two months. So yeah, let's go. Gee. This lovely place is located on Kalakaua Avenue, right after Home Bar and before the Convention Center. Since it was everyone's first time being there, we took a little bit of time to look through the menu. First off, we had Sukune meatballs tossed in curry teriyaki sauce in a poblano pepper. Also next, spring rolls with cod roe and chicken, ground chicken with curry and soy sauce glaze, and nojo fries which have bonito flakes, takoyaki sauce, and kewpie mayo. One of our big favorites for the night was the nikumaki rice ball. So it was a rice ball that was wrapped with pork belly, and I believe it was deep fried, and then covered in either spicy garlic chili, or cheese, or both, but it was yummy. This pork kale roll was okay. It didn't really match the pictures that we had seen um, from other people who tried out the place before, and was just, I don't know, it's just okay. Round two of our cheese balls. And our last entree for the evening was the Bijin Nabe that had chicken and vegetables. I don't know, the big draw of this hot pot was the chicken based collagen soup. So that lovely gelatinous stuff that you see there melting in the pot. Um, it tasted really good, kind of just like a really rich chicken soup base. And I think someone had said that the collagen is supposed to be good for your hair, skin, and nails. Either way, delicious! So the chicken in this nabe was a ground chicken meatball, that same sukune meatball that um, we earlier saw with the poblano pepper. Um, lots of veggies, including these little ra radish ribbons. Sorry, that was a tongue twister. Radish ribbons um, that Kimmy's putting in. And also, I guess when your soup stock is running low in the pot, you do get one free refill of the collagen when you order one of the collagen nabes that they have here. And of course, it was time for dessert. We actually ended up getting almost everything on the dessert menu, so that included the Instagram famous polar bear and yellow bear. The polar bear and yellow bear were two shaved ice dishes that had mixed fruit, mochi, black beans, and vanilla ice cream as those faces. The only difference is that the polar bear had milk syrup and the yellow bear had mango sauce. The Monaka ice cream sandwich, which came in green tea black sesame, lily koi, and mango was all right, kind of hard. And the matcha berry tiramisu was also kind of meh. So just go for the shave ice bears. And that wraps up our quick review of Sukata Nojo. Thanks for watching.